A real good stretch early on with Ryan Benesh in the second quarter, just getting inside. He had a hot, hot stick, off. right? I mean, we were, we shot terribly last night. Uh, we talked about it, um, you know, and he stepped up. I mean, that's what good players do, and, and you know, we need a different guy every night, or you know, and if Ryan wants to do it all year, I'm okay with that too. So, um, but I mean, it was night and day. The ball was moving. We were more patient. We were uh, controlling the 30-second clock. You know, and we were we were only satisfied with the um, quality shots. We weren't uh, taking uh, the 50-footers. Any relief come over the bench after you guys killed off Priolo's seven minutes? Yeah, I mean, he obviously it was. I mean, uh, you know, those guys that were out there killing that uh, penalty was amazing. Like Billy D. Smith had one hell of a game. That guy gave us some good time tonight, and you know, um, you know, all the defense. Like, you know, I mean, Kevin Bernal is he's, he's unreal. Like the kid is getting better and better. I don't know about you guys, but he's had two great games. Keto Hill uh, gets every loose ball, and you know, I mean, that's what it takes to win. We didn't have that last night, and you brought it tonight. And you know, um, that's it's what it's, that's what it's going to take. First weekend, it looks like five on five. You guys got to be real happy with the way it looks. Five on five. Obviously, today the penalties were, were frustrating, and, and yesterday some penalty trouble. But five on five, happy with what you've seen from the first two games. Yeah, yeah. Um, defensively, very happy. Um, you know, we, we we communicated really well tonight. Uh, made some good switches uh, when they tried to do a couple plays on us, and, and you know, um, that's a key. Uh, offensively, I was real happy tonight as well. Last night I wasn't so happy, but you know it's a work in progress. We're you know second game, so um, you know we got a long way to go, but you know, we're happy. Is a game like this coming off last night, the travel, fun and games you had coming in today, uh, make it especially sweet to hang on for this one? Yeah, it, it does. Obviously, you want to um, uh, protect home. You want to win at home. You want to be a tough team to, to play at home. Um, I thought we did that for, for the most part of the game, and, and um, um, you know, I mean, everybody does the long road trips in the early mornings and, you know, the, the quick lunches and things like that that's part of this league, but, you know, and that's just an excuse. We, we had to come and play tonight because we didn't last night, and, you know, we redeemed ourselves, and so I mean, that was good. Cosmo seemed like he settled down there in the second half, and obviously it was a big part of that penalty kill tonight. Yeah, Cosmo. Cause was real good last night as well. I mean, you know, we're going to break down. Uh, this is the nature of the game, but, uh, you know, you need a wall there, and he's been a wall. So, um, you know, he gave us some quality uh, saves tonight, huge saves, one, and important ones at the right times. Is so, it a planned night off for JT, or uh, yep. is he okay? Yep, yep, yep he's okay. And now uh, Watt uh, scheduled to dress, and then Rich took the foot? Yes, uh, Watt just has a lower, uh, lower body injury that we thought we was going to be ready to go, and it wasn't, so uh, you know, he, he'll get another two weeks off, and, and we'll, we'll uh, see how it is when uh, we play in two weeks. Troy, I know you're full of sympathy with what Derek Keenan has gone through and the passing of his, his wife, and I'm sure that emotionally it's hard to know what to expect out of an opponent that's gone through something like that. It's obviously a difficult time for everybody. It, it is. Uh, obviously, it's weighed on the mind of, the, of that team, and, and you know, Derek's such a big part of this league, and, and you know has been for a long time. And um, you know we just we've, this, this league and, and lacrosse you know, has had a tough time the last uh, three or four months. And you know some good people have, have left us. Um, you know and we can just uh, support them and you know uh, carry on. Yeah. Thank you.